Cupu. Que teníamos que hacer un vídeo, ¿te acuerdas? ¿Qué vídeo? El de las preguntas. Teníamos que hacerlo hace un mes. <risa> es verdad. Venga, vamos, 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 vamos vale, ahora. Vale, vale, vale. Will there be future Warcry Adventures releases that can also be used in the war game? At the moment, we are not working or planning on any more Warcry Adventures products, apart from the core box, the expansion, and the two alternative enemy boxes that you can get on retail too. But in the future, maybe who knows? Does the roadbook include the rules to use the minis from Warcry Adventures, or do we have to wait a little bit more? The miniatures from Walker Adventures will follow exactly the same rules as the ones collected in the rulebook. However, the specifications required will come on the profiles. Will Warcrow be scenario-oriented like Infinity or mostly combat? Warcrow has a variety of very rich scenarios, different from one another regarding objectives, requirements, available actions, and so on. And trust me, with this one, Warcrow is very, very much scenario-oriented. One of the key elements to the gameplay is position. Um, plus, of course, we will have narrative campaigns, like the one included in the first box, Winds from the North. We have the competitive dimension, which we are working on as I am speaking we're working on the competitive division of Warcrow and that perhaps will be slightly more combat oriented but yeah will Warcrow have an army app such as Infinities is there a way that I can manage via an app my armies in Warcrow yes multiple questions have arrived regarding the app and yeah we're developing right now an app to manage your armies in Warcrow is the silhouette size relevant at all in the game and how can we expect the models behave regarding the size? Silhouette is not relevant in Warcrow, although the size of the models is uh, it spices up the profiles a lot via skills, characteristics, you'll see that. And regarding the size, our models will have either bases for 30 millimeters and 60 millimeters. I can't do inches, I'm so sorry. Do you plan to make a miniatures war game with large armies in the Warcraft universe or will you focus only on a skirmish type games like Infinity? The average number of models in a standard game is between 15 to 20 per player and army, so definitely greater than Infinity, yet not as large as other war games that are currently on the market. What is the size for the standard game table? The standard game table is 3x3 three three or 90cm by 90cm. Is the game thought for standard size of an army or will we have different categories or point limits? The standard list we are navigating at the moment is 250 points. However, it is possible that the scenarios have different troops requirements or maximum number of points that you can accumulate in your list. So we'll see. What is the maximum number of miniatures per unit? Do I have to buy more than one starter box to maximize the quantity of orcs? The answer is no. The maximum quantity of troops per unit is specified by the product. Unless another rules or scenario requirements specify the opposite, you will never have units that go further than that established number. In other words, no, you cannot uh, play with eight orcs in your unit, even though you buy two starter boxes. Any plans for multiplayer, three to four mode? Currently the war game is one versus one. For multiplayer, you can play our dungeon crawler, War Crawl Adventures. Can we expect mounted models? Or are we talking only on foot? Yeah, there will be mounted models. Why? Have you peeped something in any video that called your attention? Will there be large base models for every army? Well, if you've been following us around, you've already seen the Crucible from the Red Cabs or the Kiplich and Mormab from the Science of Yaldabaoth. So this means, yes, every army is going to have large based miniatures. How much is the box? The box has a price of 129.95 euros. Can pre-orders be made through retailers or exclusively Corvus Belli? No, you can make your pre-order via your local store. If you're interested in Warcrow, contact the store and tell them to write us here at Corvus Valley. And you have it. If someone wants to host an event in their area to help spread awareness of the game, is there support for that? If you're thinking about hosting a demo at either your local club or your local store, please send us an email at contact at 
Just an idea, have you considered doing an ongoing living narrative campaign where narrative games played throughout the year shape the story of the world? Given the experience we've had with Infinity so far, it is entirely possible that we embark also in narrative adventures within Warcrow. I wasn't able to afford Warcrow Adventures when it went off Kickstarter. Could I possibly buy it later? Yes, Warcrow Adventures is going to be a retail product on sale later this year. How does terrain work? Do we have heights and levels as in Infinity? No, Warcrow does not use terrain as Infinity does, and we don't have heights or levels. However, terrain will come with buffs or debuffs, like cover and such. You can see all the details in our rulebook, which is available to download. What will objectives be like? Should we expect mostly hold a point, like in the Adepticon demo, or more complex objectives like in Infinity? Objectives will be as varied as the scenarios, and sometimes you will have to fight for them, you will have to conquer them, maybe you can move them, maybe there is something you must do in order to attain the point, or do something else. <laughs> what material are the miniatures? All the miniatures from the Warcrow war game are made in injected thermoplastic made here at home in Carlos Valley. I can show you some. Uh, here we have Ice Bear, who you know already, you've seen him. And also I have... Uh... Now that I think of it, maybe not this one. How quickly can we expect rules for all six factions or will they have profiles so players can proxy earlier? Rules are exactly the same for all nations all the specifications come in the profiles you cannot however get the profiles before the product hits retail when does the pre-order start the pre-order kicks off july 15 and it's open until august 4. if you make your pre-order then you can get the bundle which includes this wonderful lustrous box the core rule book with all the stories and narrative in there and also ice bear Will the game be available in and insert the language? From the start, Warcrow will be available in English and Spanish, but we are working in bringing you the game also in other languages. Stay tuned for that. How simple is Warcrow? Depends on what game you're looking for. Warcrow is, a sim is simple to learn, but it's difficult to master and is a game with a lot of layers. Like an onion, profiles are approachable and mechanics and rules are very easy to learn. However, mastering the synergies between the armies and your troops can take a while, so entirely up to you. Will I be able to play with the Red Cups? Yes, as we've been saying from the beginning, every single miniature from Warcraft Winters will be playable in the war game, except for the giant mort map and the dragon. Those, those you can't play with. For the rest you can. How long does a game last? It truly depends on the scenario and also on the experience from the players. It's not the same thing tackling the war game for the first time or maybe you've had several other scenarios on your back. However, the times we're managing currently are between 60 and 90 minutes average. And please mind, this is average and just an estimation. Should you need more time? That's entirely perfect. Should you need less time? It's also perfect. The narrative campaign in Winds of the North, is it only for hegemony versus northern tribes? Or can I play it with other factions? Also, will all the boxes come with new narrative campaigns? So, Wimps from the North is tailored to the Hegemony and the Northern Tribes, so you can only play it with them. However, however, we're considering maybe adapting certain things in the future. And also, future battle boxes will also come with their own original campaign. When will be the rulebook available for download? Now you can go to our website and get the rules. Go! Will the profiles be available somewhere to download? Yes, when the army app for Warcraft is released, there you will have all the profiles available for downloading. Will I be able to purchase a scenery pack separately? Yeah, definitely in the future you will be able to do so. And also, yes, we'll have all the scenery packages ready for download. And now, off you go.